Aloha everyone, I'm Ali Ikubayo and I'm the star of Disney Animation's newest film, Moana. In the film, Moana sets out to discover a new world across the sea while facing many challenges, including a trap of seemingly cute coconut-clad pirates called the Kakamora. While the Kakamora may be cute, they can be quite menacing as a team. Here's where I need you. Join me and our team, the Village of Coders, in discovering and navigating the new world of coding to help defeat the Kakamura on our latest journey. From the movies we love, to the websites we visit, to the animation in our favorite films and TV shows, our world is shaped by code. And through the power of coding, you too can guide your quest, wayfinding your world, and perhaps discover a master coder in you. So join the Village of Coders with me and some surprise friends in the 2016 Hour of Code. The world of code is calling. Computer science is a part of everyday life, from the cars we drive to the movies we watch. And it is definitely used here at the Disney Consumer Products and Interactive Campus. In the next hour, you'll learn some of the basics of how to code using the characters from the movie Moana. Plus, we'll introduce you to some of the professionals who work for the Walt Disney Company that use these concepts every day. Anybody can learn computer science, and we hope you have fun doing the Hour of Code. Now let's get to it with Moana and Maui. Before you start, let's learn how to use the Moana Hour of Code tutorial. Your screen is split into three parts. On the left is the Moana game space where the code will run. To complete a puzzle, move Moana and Maui on the square path to reach the circle. The instructions for each level are written above the game space. If you get stuck, reread the instructions and try again. This middle area is the toolbox, and each of these blocks is a command that Moana and Maui can understand. The blank yellow space on the right is called the workspace, and this is where we're going to build our program. You'll notice at the top there's a number. These are the amount of blocks you need to solve the puzzle. If I drag the move forward block to our workspace, what happens? Moana moves forward one block on the grid. And what if I want Moana to do something after the move forward block? I can add another block to our program. I'm going to choose the turn left block, and I'll drag it under my move forward block until the highlight appears. Then I'll drop it and the two blocks will snap together. When I press run again, Moana will perform the commands that are stacked top to bottom on our workspace. If you ever want to delete a block, just remove it from the stack and drag it back into the toolbox. After you hit run, you can always hit the reset button to get Moana back to the start. Now, let's get sailing. 